be a voiceover. I don't know. Um, but basically we're going to try and recreate a pour that I just did. And the base is Artist Loft Flow Black. And I've already painted the edges of my canvas. My canvas is an Artist Loft Level 2, 12 by 12 inch. And what we're gonna do is, I was experimenting. I got these new paints in, and they're called Sax Versa Temp, Heavy Body Tempura. And I know there's a lot of, should you use tempura, shouldn't you? I don't see why not. I mean, but anyway, so we're gonna be using the copper and the silver. I got these in a three pack on Amazon and you can tell the bottles are quite, quite big. And I mixed these with my pouring medium. I mixed them half and half and they're a pint. They're, they're a full pint. Um, let's see. Yeah. 16, 16 fluid ounces. All three bottles, $15. Yep. So I thought, why not? Let's take a chance on it. Give it a shot. You know, I can always use them for something else because I'm a rock painter. So, and I use a lot of gold and silver and copper in my outlining. And so I thought, why not? It's worth the it's worth the chance. And I did a little um, 10 by 10 canvas board test on it, and oh my gosh, it came out so pretty. This was an open cup pour that I spun. And I just think it's gorgeous. Look at how that sold up. That is that gorgeous. I love it. And of course, because it came out so pretty <laughs> on the test canvas, I was like, shoot, now I gotta do it on a, now I gotta try it on a regular canvas because that just, I thought it blew my mind and it was so pretty. So here we go. Um, I mixed my paints, my Artist Loft Flow Black, right there. I mixed that with my pouring medium. Um, let's see, one part paint, two parts pouring medium. My pouring medium is Elmer's School Blue good old-fashioned school glue that is mixed with 60% glue 40% water and then it's mixed real well so. okay well, let's get this party started huh Yeah, if you don't want your black floating on top, your base color to come up, if you just mix it slightly thinner than the colors that you're going to be using, your black will stay below and your colors should stay on top. So, okay, let's pour a little bit of black in there, lift that cup up off the kick in there, lift that cup up off the canvas. Okay, here's our first. This is the silver.
And yes, I'm spitting it while my cup is still up there. those cells. That is cool. Okay, a little bit more black. A little bit more copper. Alright. And much more black. Okay. Ah, shoot. I dribbled. so many air bubbles because I did just literally mix this paint right before I poured it, which I really don't like to do. Wow. Okay, I'm going to tilt a little bit. Even the sides are pretty.